All right, Fit Lifers, Drew Canoli, welcome to another Fit Life episode. Remember, we're in this together, and this video, it's February, it's Valentine's Day, let's talk about love. I have a special guest today. You've seen her in movies such as The Wedding Singer, 51st Dates, all types of other classic hits like Charlie's Angels. She's here to talk about love today, the one, the only, Drew Barrymore. Drew, welcome to the show. Oh, I'm doing so well. Thank you so much for having me on the show. I'm just so blessed to be in the Fit Life TV studios. So what was the type of juice we had, Drew? It was the Drew Barrymore juice. We made it specifically for you. It's good for your heart. It's loaded with raspberries, blueberries, all types of berries that are really good for your circulatory system. Oh, thank you so much, sweetheart. Thank you so much. Now, how long have you been juicing, Drew? Oh, I've been juicing for, well, I went on Juicing Vegetables fan page, Facebook and the YouTube channel, and I've been juicing for about two years. And I love it, I absolutely, it's helped me with my hair. I mean, look at my hair, it wasn't like this before. My relationships it's helped me with. And I love the community, tell me about the community. The community's awesome, right? So it, in Valentine's Day, you know, and around February, we, we get into this whole theme of love, okay? It's important to love yourself, right? So I wanna make sure that uh, people know that in this video, and you're the expert at it because you've shot all of these movies that are all centered around pretty much the same entire thing, and uh, you've done these movies over and over and over again. So let's talk a little bit about that. Is that cool? Yeah, totally. Well, in the movie Fifty First Dates, it was really a movie based on living the same date over and over and over again, and really, well, I kind of forgot what my movie was about, but basically, it was about loving yourself so much that people fell in love with you and as soon as you get to that point of really loving yourself, the whole world loves you back. How would you describe your love for yourself now? I love myself. I wake up in the morning and I'm like, Drew Barrymore, I love you. I say it all the day, all day long. I love you, I love you. And it just happens, I just love myself. So do you think now that you love yourself, you'll find the love of your life, or have you already found the love of your life? I think it's, it's much more of a possibility. It totally is. Excellent. <laughs> yeah. Well, thank you for coming on the show, oh. Drew Barrymore. Is there any last thing you want to leave to the audience here? I just want to say that I love all of you for watching this and following me and, and watching the, the Fit Life TV channel. I think it's amazing. And I love you, and we're in this together. Thank you so much. All right, so basically what Drew is saying is, is that you gotta love yourself. You gotta find it deep within yourself to truly you know, look in the mirror and love what you see. A lot of people out there in the community today, they look in the mirror and they don't really like what they see. They travel throughout their working day and they just are kind of down, they're kind of negative. And they feel like this perpetual motion, it gets just, just get worse and worse every single day. Eventually to a point to where you don't really admire yourself at all. And if you don't admire yourself, who's gonna admire you? Who's really gonna love you? So it all starts with loving yourself. So Drew explained very eloquently that you can start by changing your thoughts. When you can change your thoughts and start saying positive stuff about you, your reality will start to shift. When you can get in this really deep state of gratitude, when you're alone, when you have nobody else around you, when you're in the comfort of your own home and you're the only person in there and you can enjoy that time, because you love you. That's what Drew was talking about. So that's what this video is all about. It's about developing a relationship with yourself. It's about getting to that point, to really admiring yourself. And it's, it's almost like the divorceless relationship, right? Because you're the only person that came into this world, and when you leave, you're the only person that's going out. So you gotta love yourself first. So Drew Canoli, remember, we're in this together. Thank you, Drew, for coming on the show. We'll see you guys next time.